Hey everybody, what's up and welcome back to today's video guys and today guys I'm going to go ahead and be showing you how to bass boost in GarageBand. This is a very simple thing to do so make sure to watch this quick and easy video till the very end follow my steps correctly so you can make sure this works the same for you and you can do this yourself. But yeah guys let's get straight into it. So the first thing you want to do is to go ahead and open up the official GarageBand application on your mobile phone if you're not already. If you do not have the application just go to the app store and download it and after opening it up you'll be greeted by this main page right here which is the home page where you can find all the instruments you can play you have your audio recorder as well and so on. So let's go ahead and see how we can get started making bass boosted music and garage band so the first thing i'm going to do is open up my track so i'm going to do that by clicking the audio record option right here that's going to open up this recording menu and in the upper left corner i can click this middle button to open up my track menu where you can find all the options all the tracks i have and so on so let's go ahead and see how to get started with bass boosting basically guys we are going to be using bass boosting options found in the fx and sliders option right here i'm going to show you so select the track you want to bass boost let's say my audio recording right here and now we're going to take a look at this option right here click the sliders option at the top of the screen that's going to open up the track settings right here now we have our track settings as well as plugins equalizers and master effects so you can go ahead and get started with adding your master effects such as your echo reverb and so on whatever you might want to use to get a bass boosted effect but what you want to really do is go into plugins and equalizer right here and get started with using the visual equalizer so using the visual equalizer you can now go ahead and see the bass option at the left side of the screen that you can go ahead and increase so you can add more bass or reduce bass this is how you get started with adding your bass and selecting how much base you want to add so once you're satisfied just leave it right there and click done in the upper left corner and after that you'll be able to satis be satisfied with the result of the base boosted uh, song so yeah basically that is it how to do it so i hope this video was helpful if it was make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel so you guys thanks for watching take care and bye